You're probably familiar with weightlifting competitions. You may have seen dynamic overhead movements like the clean and jerk in the Olympics. Yeah, but powerlifting is more like what you see in the gym. Bench press, squats, and deadlifts. It's not an Olympic sport yet, but one of the best powerlifters in the world lives in Lincoln County. Oh my gosh, you guys are going crazy. Oh, yeah. Lincoln Charters Jen Thompson is passionate about the two courses she teaches. And in the last two years, I've been teaching um, honors nutrition and all girls health PE. Carrots don't because they're roots, right? For Thompson, they aren't just subjects. They're part of her lifestyle, one that's taken her around the world. A distance runner in college, Thompson found herself living with a group of roommates who shared a passion for weightlifting to the point they set up a gym in the basement of their rental house. I would go for my run, I'd come back and I'd hear them like down there lifting, a big group of eight or ten guys down there lifting and they were laughing and cheering for each other and having a great time. Let's go Jeff, come on now! Intimidated at first, Thompson eventually joined in and fell in love with the sport. I became very strong and, and grew a lot of strength and I really liked the um, what it did for my body and uh, my mind. And the roommate. When I married the guy that got me into the gym. <laughs> on their honeymoon, Jen and Donovan Thompson watched a powerlifting competition on Venice Beach. <laughs> Jen started training and entered her first competition. Broke a bunch of records and I've been traveling the country since then. Not just this country. My very first trip was to Finland. Three lift worlds in Sweden. Jen Thompson is a world champion 10 times over holding two world records, which she set and broken 68 times in her 20-year powerlifting career. No way in my wildest dreams would I think that, A, I would find this sport that I'm really great at, and that I would be at the best in the world at it. I mean, who thinks that? You know, I was just a small little long-distance runner. You know, I came from a little town. The rental house they used in college is a distant memory, but the training method is the same. <laughs> Thompson and her friends and family gather at 4 p.m. to work out. Good. And we cheer for each other and we play loud music and we talk about our days and we tell jokes and it's more of like a fun social time, although you're really getting a lot of good heavy training in. Among those training every day, Thompson's two children. Her oldest, Tucker, traveled to Finland with Jen and her husband last December. The trio became the first mother, father, and son to compete in the world championships together. And for me, I mean, there's nothing better than see your kids do something pretty great, you know, and be successful at things. So, um, and I love that we can do it together. It's a, a fam family affair. But it's not just her own children she's guiding to a healthier lifestyle. The all-girls physical education class is one that's particularly important to Thompson. It was powerlifting that made her stronger, not just physically, but mentally and emotionally. And she's trying to pass those life lessons on in a setting where the girls are more comfortable and confident. Um, they feel like they can actually get, get in and play whatever game that we're playing and they're not getting you know shoved out or worried about what the boys are thinking about them or how they look. So it's been um, really great for them. Thompson is one of the most recognizable power lifters in the country and embraces her role as an ambassador for women in her sport. The numbers are growing. When she first started, only a handful of women could compete. Now they make up half the field. 